The Port of Corpus Christi, the fourth largest port in the United States by tonnage, it moves more than 100 million tons of cargo and much of the nation's energy resources every year. This sprawling 22,000 acre complex is vital to our nation's economic security. Protecting it is a top priority and a massive undertaking. We have a, a complete security apparatus here from manned patrols around the port to waterborne security to a, a system where we can monitor each and every dock. The security system here is designed to protect the community, the port, and our customers. Since 9-11, the port has invested more than $70 million in new infrastructure to upgrade its security capabilities, which go far beyond the Port of Corpus Christi Police Department. The department is a central element in a multi-layered security structure. We have about 25 police officers now. We are backed up by some 400 police officers at Corpus Christi Police Department. Our jurisdiction is in San Patricio County and Nueces County. So we're backed up by all of the local law enforcement agencies in those communities in our region. We're backed up by the Coast Guard. We're backed up by DPS on water and on land. DPS being Department of Public Safety or the State Police. And all of the bureaus that encompass the State Police to include the Texas Rangers. All of them supported by an incredibly advanced surveillance system with several hundred cameras tied into a central command center, which oversees what's called an intelligent video analytics network. We select a certain area that we know is very critical to us. We can't have a policeman there 24 seven, but we can have eyes on that spot 24 seven. Somebody, whether it's a person, a vehicle, a bicycle, a bird, whatever it is, we want to know when that one type of body goes into that alert region. When it does, we get automatic alerts and we see what needs to be seen at that moment. If you're in the maritime domain, you can pretty much rest assured that you're on camera. You're also within minutes reach of the port's newest addition. This quick response fireboat is a first for the Port of Corpus Christi and blasts more than 6,000 gallons of water per minute. It also compounds the foam capability of the port's existing fire barge, giving the port multiple options for battling oil and gas fires. The fire barge moves at around two to three knots. Uh, this moves at around 24 knots, so we can move about 12 times quicker. Anywhere up and down the, the channel, the inner harbor, we can do something much more rapidly and move a large volume of water and foam to do the same thing that we were able to do with the fire barge. We're about asset protection. We're about ensuring that the infrastructure that we're investing in and our customers are investing in are secure from any type of threat, man-made, or natural. For more information on security at the Port of Corpus Christi, visit portofcc.com.